It's sad. It's sad. In the daylight, police markers show where bullets pierced a number of different homes on Fillmore Street. In the dark on Wednesday, police investigate who shot off 17 different rounds. I guarantee you, like, na every neighbor that was probably up around that time was calling 911 because when I was calling, I didn't get an answer. One mother who does not want to be named to protect her safety says she was in one of the homes that was shot. I didn't know what to think. At one point, I was just standing up in the middle of the hallway. She says several children under the age of seven were sleeping inside when the gunman showed up. Because there's six kids in this house and they knew it. They didn't care. She says the firefight lasted about five minutes. One man was injured in the rear end and he shot back. I thank God that the, the victim that was here, he actually had a gun because I feel like they would have tried to walk in the house. She pleads for this to stop. If this keep happening, eventually somebody is going to end up dead behind all of it. This woman and the children shaken up but ultimately okay. She says she thinks God, her five-month-old, won't remember what happened early Wednesday morning. And surprisingly, she slept through all of it. She slept through everything.